at Unilever, we've had one of our sort of key parts of marketing. We talk uh, about crafting brands for life. Putting people first is, is, is the very first one. I think marketers should be curious. They should be curious about what's going on um, and they should learn uh, from what's around them. Um, and I think that's the, the first thing before you even start talking about data. But now we have access to huge amounts of data. Um, so I've set up the people data centers um, in Unilever. We now have uh, 28 of these people data centers around the world. Uh, and they are 24-7 uh, monitoring uh, the social uh, network. We have found uh, we've got real-time insights on what people are talking about on social media uh, and real-time action then, both in content creation and, and uh, reacting to what's going on in a way never before. And by the way, you know, we've saved over 100 million in market research as well. So we've replaced it with the people data centers to give us that, that richer uh, data-based uh, people's interest. We're now moving at the speed of technology and change is just going to be ongoing. Um, and we've got to learn to adjust with it. And we need to move as fast as the consumer. The difficulty right now, as I look at it, the consumer is moving more quickly than the industry. And that's why it's time you feel behind, because we are. To get to the future first, yeah, we've got to sort of bring the outside in uh, and really understand where, where the world is going. And then we need our agencies to be with us there too. I think one of the pieces of work that I'm most proud of that has impacted uh, both society uh, and indeed uh, our business is uh, the work we've been doing uh, around advertising and changing advertising to make it a little bit more representative of where people are now. Advertising impacts culture. If advertising didn't have power, then we wouldn't all be spending billions on it. But let's use that power in a positive way to build our brands, but also to build society in a more positive way. What's interesting about hashtag and stereotype is we're starting with gender. I mean, gender is, is a huge challenge, particularly in advertising, uh, but it goes much further than that. I think the one thing uh, that would make marketing better is, is to get back to what marketing really is. And I think what we should do is get back to brands and the purpose they have. If we get that to the heart of marketing around consumer demand-led growth, understanding what consumers want, we can make marketing noble again and we can make society the centre of what marketing serves.